When we talk about peace, we talk of peace after war. But tonight, I also want you to think about being at peace with nature. Look around you. Global warming is a reality we cannot ignore. As we begin a new year, a new year in our next report, we bring you stories from three different corners of the world. My hope is that it will serve as a wake-up call. Our journey begins in California, where the ocean is unleashing its fury. Massive waves, some as high as 20 feet, are crashing along the coast. This is not a natural phenomenon. This is an indicator of a deeper disturbance. As we speak, coastal areas are on high alert for flooding and damage to infrastructure is mounting. Beaches eroded, people injured, rescue work underway. The National Weather Service warns of life-threatening conditions, a direct consequence of powerful cyclones over the northern Pacific. But this story is not just about the ocean's wrath. It's about a global pattern that's becoming impossible to ignore. Let's shift our focus to India. This is Delhi NCR. Here, the winter that once brought chills is now essentially missing. Experts are linking this to global warming. Meteorologists say the average temperatures in Delhi during the winter have been steadily rising. The typical chilly days marked by dense fog and a biting cold are becoming rare. The number of cold wave days has dropped significantly. In other words, the famous Delhi winter is a thing of the past. Experts say that get ready for near non-existent winters and short springs in the future. And then there is New Zealand a country famous for its natural beauty. Here, the government is taking drastic measures to combat a rat infestation that threatens their precious native birds. The rats, flourishing due to extreme weather conditions, are a glaring example of how climate change impacts biodiversity. Experts say if the world continues on its current path, the Earth's temperature will rise by 2 to 5 degrees Celsius by the end of the century. At that rate, rats will be reproducing all year round. The rat crisis is not limited to New Zealand. Many countries are facing a rat scourge. The bottom line is this. Each of these stories, from California's raging waves, India's shrinking winter months, to New Zealand's battle with rats, are signs of a dangerous trend. What binds these stories together is the need for being at peace with nature. Ask yourself, what are you doing to restore balance? While leaders, policymakers, and each one of us has a role to play. The time for debate is over. It's time for action was yesterday. Bureau Report, we on. World is one. We on World is one is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.